Sophia Loren is an Italian actress. With a career spanning over 70 years, she was named by the American Film Institute as one of the greatest stars of classical Hollywood cinema and is one of the last surviving major stars from the era. Lauren began her film career at age 16 in 1950. Debbie Reynolds was an American actress, singer, and businesswoman. Her career spanned almost 70 years. She was nominated for a Golden Globe Award for Most Promising Newcomer with her portrayal of Helen Kane in the 1950 film Three Little Words. Ava Lavinia Gardner was an American actress. During the 1950s, Gardner established herself as a leading lady and one of the era's top stars. She was a part of the golden age of Hollywood. Ava Gardner was born on December 24, 1922, in Grabtown, North Carolina. Olivia de Havilland was a British and American actress. The major works of her cinematic career spanned from 1935 to 1988. She appeared in 49 feature films and was one of the leading actresses of her time. Her younger sister was Oscar-winning actress Joan Fontaine. Lucille Ball was an American actress and comedienne. She was nominated for 13 Primetime Emmy Awards, winning five times, and was the recipient of several other accolades, such as the Golden Globe Cecil B. D'Amelio Award and two stars on the Hollywood Walk of Fame. Piper Laurie was an American actress. She received various accolades, including a Primetime Emmy Award and a Golden Globe Award, in addition to nominations for three Academy Awards and a BAFTA Award. Piper Laurie was born in Detroit, Michigan, on January 22, 1932. Taylor Dane is an American singer, songwriter, and actress. She rose to fame in 1987 after her debut single, Tell It To My Heart. Dane achieved six additional U.S. Top 10 singles, including Love Will Lead You Back, With Every Beat Of My Heart, Prove Your Love, and I'll Always Love You. Taylor Dane was born in Manhattan. Angie Dickinson is an American retired actress. She began her career on television, appearing in many anthology series during the 1950s, before gaining her breakthrough role in Gun, The Man Down with James Arness and the Western film Rio Bravo with John Wayne and Dean Martin, for which she received the Golden Globe Award for New Star of the Year. Mila Jovovich is an American actress and model. Her starring roles in numerous science fiction and action films led the music channel VH1 to deem her the reigning queen of kick butt in 2006. In 2004, Forbes determined that she was the highest paid model in the world. Jovovich was born on December 17, 1975. Elizabeth Taylor was a British and American actress. Throughout her career, Taylor's personal life was the subject of constant media attention. She was married eight times to seven men, converted to Judaism, endured several serious illnesses, and led a jet-set lifestyle, including assembling one of the most expensive private collections of jewelry in the world. Ginger Rogers was an American actress, dancer, and singer during the golden age of Hollywood. She won an Academy Award for Best Actress for her starring role in Kitty Foyle and performed during the 1930s in Rico's musical films with Fred Astaire. Ginger Rogers was born in Independence, Missouri. Audrey Hepburn was a British actress. Hepburn rose to stardom in the romantic comedy Roman Holiday alongside Gregory Peck, for which she was the first actress to win an Oscar, a Golden Globe Award, and a BAFTA Award for a single performance. That year, she also won a Tony Award for Best Lead Actress in a play for her performance in Ondin. Grace Kelly was an American actress and Princess of Monaco. She is known as an iconic actress of the Golden Age of Hollywood. She received an Academy Award, three Golden Globe Awards, and was ranked 13th on the American Film Institute's 25 Greatest Female Stars list. Loretta Young was an American actress. Starting as a child, she had a long and varied career in film from 1917 to 1953. She received numerous honors including an Academy Award, two Golden Globe Awards, 
and three Primetime Emmy Awards, as well as two stars on the Hollywood Walk of Fame for her work in film and television. Juliette Compton was an American actress whose career began in the silent film era and concluded with that Hamilton woman in 1941. Compton was born in Columbus, Georgia, on May 3, 1899. She was a model for illustrator Harrison Fisher, and perhaps his favorite model. Jane Mansfield was an American actress, singer, nightclub entertainer, and Playboy playmate. Mansfield gained popularity after playing the role of fictional actress Rita Marlowe in Will Success Spoil Rock Hunter? on Broadway, which she reprised in the film adaptation of the same name in 1957. Jane Mansfield was born in Bryn Mawr, Pennsylvania. Carol Lombard was an American actress. In 1999, the American Film Institute ranked Lombard 23rd on its list of the greatest female stars of classic Hollywood cinema. She made her screen debut in A Perfect Crime at the age of 12. Lombard was born in Fort Wayne, Indiana. Ida Lupino was a British actress, director, writer, and producer. Throughout her 48-year career, she appeared in 59 films and directed eight, working primarily in the United States, where she became a citizen in 1948. Lupino was born at 33 Ardbeg Road in Hern Hill, London. Priscilla Lane was an American actress, and the youngest sibling in the Lane sisters family of singers and actresses. She is best remembered for her roles in the films The Roaring Twenties, Saboteur, and Arsenic and Old Lace. Priscilla Mulligan was born in Indianola, Iowa. Jean Rogers was an American actress who starred in serial films in the 1930s and low-budget feature films in the 1940s as a leading lady. She is best remembered for playing Dale Arden in the science fiction serials Flash Gordon and Flash Gordon's Trip to Mars. Her last appearance was in a supporting role in the suspense film The Second Woman. Alice Faye was an American actress and singer. Faye starred in such films as On the Avenue and Alexander's Ragtime Band. She is often associated with the Academy Award-winning standard You'll Never Know, which she introduced in the 1943 musical film Hello, Frisco, Hello! Joan Blondell was an American actress who performed in film and television for 50 years. Blondell began her career in vaudeville. After winning a beauty pageant, she embarked on a film career, establishing herself as a pre-code staple of Warner Bros. Rose Joan Blondell was born in New York City, 